Um, hello. I was wondering about your workshops, and I've invited some friends, but they were curious about that it's a shamanic workshop, and they've had some bad experiences with people using the word shamanic. Mm. So how is what you're doing different or um, more applicable so people know that you're actually really teaching them true Tungan shamans come from Siberia, so they should note that if they don't, a lot of people don't know that. So you're coming from a deep background of the tradition of where shamanism comes from, but it's a very misused word mm -hmm. nowadays Agreed. in culture. People are putting them on themselves every five minutes. So, what distinguishes you from these other people who are using the label shaman? Mm. Yes, thank you for this question very much, because yeah. I agree completely that uh, nowadays this world shaman is um, has like karma, negative karma. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. And in uh, naturally, uh, people do not understand what does it mean. That's why uh, even now many um, uh, spiritual teachers who are shamans from different traditions, not only in Siberia, from yeah. Mexican traditions, from Latin American traditions, they prefer to not call themselves like shamans. Mm -hmm. Yes, they usually call themselves like medicine people, uh, healer, or any other words to use, but not only shaman. Because the word shaman uh, is like, I don't like this word, but it's manipulation. Yeah. Uh, when somebody uses it like a word to manipulate, to make people be scared and to have some fears about this, but all this done just not to let people um, to go forward and to experience some um, important spiritual uh, energies, uh, development, and to be at this path. Uh, it's, uh, it's not a secret <laughs> that all of us, yes, we live yeah. in this society and a lot of uh, influences, uh, manipulations with people who live, just regular people, common people. And the uh, sh word shaman is one of the methods how to make people scared and not to do anything in their life. Oh. Just to live like robots. <laughs> yes, not yes. to be conscious and just to live in this fear. Mm -hmm. uh, but uh, um, really a shaman, I also don't use very often this word, but mm -hmm. my students, when they do different promotions or uh, flyers in Facebooks, every time they call me Siberian shaman, I thought, oh, please don't do it because people will not understand. <laughs> right. Yes, but they told that, uh, you know, that the real shaman, the world shaman comes from Siberia. It's very, very, very ancient tradition. And shaman is the person who has special um, view, look at this world. Mm -hmm. So who is shaman? The person who accepts that everything around us is alive. And probably you agree with me. Yes, yes. we have trees, <laughs> wonderful, beautiful trees, flowers, uh, nature, uh, animals, everything that has spirit life mm -hmm. and honestly if everybody will be shamans there will be no wars at this planet because in shamanic culture there is no any way to kill anybody or to have some aggression to destroy anything mm -hmm. anybody yes but yes unfortunately uh, this negative karma or the wrong understanding of this world mm -hmm. uh, world exists that's why okay let's call me how do you prefer? <laughs> <laughs> I accept. It doesn't matter how you call me. Yes. More important, how uh, make this more easier for people, for women to come to my workshop. Yes. Because I know what I share. And uh, this energy is really healing and very quickly transform destiny, life, health for better. That's why you can call me anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Just I want to help. Yes. Um, 